Speaking voice commands into your watch seems a little bit embarrassing, but yet once I show you some of these quick and easy tricks, it's not gonna be so embarrassing once you realize how useful this is. Learning to use the voice commands on Android Wear can take a little bit of getting used to. However, once you continually do it, especially on a day-to-day -day basis, it almost becomes like second nature. In fact, this beats having to take your phone out of your pocket or even dig down into your purse for it. And ladies, you know exactly what I'm talking about. So let me show you some quick and easy tasks that will make your life so much simpler. And this is some of that great fun that you get to have with owning a smartwatch. So to get started, we're gonna go through some quick and easy tasks that you probably already perform on a daily basis, but this time you don't need your phone. So the first example is maybe you'd like to see when your next hair appointment is, or even just to see your agenda for the day. Okay, Google, when's my next hair appointment? Okay, Google, show me my agenda for tomorrow. So you can see how clever Android Wear is because then it takes those words that you were just searching for and it goes through your entire calendar to find those phrases used so you can see your next appointment. And then it's also great to see your agenda for the day because then you know exactly what's happening for the day and this is what I do almost every single morning. Next up is don't forget that your Android Wear actually doubles up not only as a smartwatch but then also a pedometer keeping track of your daily activity or at least the steps that you're taking. So the tracking on mine had to be reset because I reset my watch to my phone, but oh well, you get the point. These next ones are gonna be really helpful if you're out running around and again, you don't have to take your phone out of your pocket or even your purse to then send yourself a note as okay, an example. Google. Note to self, buy my sister the chocolate cookbook. So your watch will take your default note-taking app, which for me is Evernote, and then save that voice command and that note right inside there and it saves it for later. So what about sending an email really quickly? Yes, you can do it straight from your Android Wear watch. Now, I don't suggest doing this for a really long email, but yet, short and sweet, you get the point, you can send emails right from your watch. You'll be asked who in your contacts to send the note to as well as the message and you are set. You can also do the same thing if you wanted to text or call somebody. For the text command, just say text, and then the contact that you're wanting to text, your message, and then it's out. And then if you wanted to make a phone call, you just say call, and then the name of the contact, you might have to choose exactly which number, and then that phone call opens up right on your phone. Now what about heading to bed? We your Android Wear Watch can help out with this as well because all you need to do is just to say, set an alarm for, and the time, and then that will set your alarm for tomorrow morning. You can also use this to set a timer. So you can say, set a timer for 20 minutes. You're set, and this is great for whenever you're baking in the kitchen. Next up are some simple questions that I always find myself Googling, but now you can just ask your watch. What about if you're wondering when a store closes? Well, just ask your watch. This will bring up the information stored in Google Maps for that location. So how about remembering time zones? Maybe you have a friend in Hawaii and you're always wondering to yourself, am I gonna wake them up? Are they still up? Just ask your watch. Just ask what time it is in a particular place and you'll get your answer. Maybe while you're out running some errands or maybe even out on a date night, you miss a very important sporting event. Sport? Well, have no fear because now you can just ask your watch what that score was. So these are just some helpful ways for you to start using voice navigation on your Android Wear device. There are so many others to choose from like translation, navigation, either way, these are gonna be some easy ones to start with, probably using them on a daily basis. And I probably guess that your phone is probably not gonna be in your hands as often. So right there, that totally deserves a thumbs up, phone in the purse, phone in your pocket, just use your watch. So be sure to subscribe because we have new videos out every single week. If there's anything you would like to see, any comments that you want to leave, please be sure to put them right inside the comment box below. I'll also link up to all the other Android Wear videos that we've done right here inside the cards as well as inside the description. 
The other thing that's inside the description are links to all of my social channels. So Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat. I would love to connect with you guys on there as well because you can see a lot of behind the scenes and get to know me a lot better. So hopefully we'll see you back next week. Brand new video. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.